My name is Srinivas. In this session, I am going to discuss about file attributes in Python. File attributes. File attributes. Attributes. File attributes in Python. Or it is also sometimes also called as a file properties. File properties. File properties in Python. Now, what is file? File means a collection of related information stored a particular area on the disk. That the area is called as a the area is called as a file name. The name of the file name. Here, the, the attributes of the file, the properties of the file are one property is one property is a name property. One property is the name property. The attributes are the properties. The first property is name property. The second property is mode, mode property. A property or attribute. Third one is writable, writable property. Third one is writable property. And fourth one is readable, readable. So first one is ordinary variable, second one is a ordinary variable, third one is function, writable, no e, writable, readable. And uh, fifth one is closed. These are the attributes, these are the attributes. So what is the name? This is, it returns, it returns, it returns the name of the file. This is the name of the file, very good. It is the name of the file, it returns, uh, Returns so, returns so, the mode of the file. It is the mode of the file. Mode of the file. Which purpose the file is open? Clear. Now, now the next one, read, read. It returns so, returns so, returns so. Either true or false. It is either true or false. Only true or false value. It also returns the true or false. This also returns either true or false value. Okay. They also return either true or false. All these are returns either true or false. When returns the true and when returns are false. For example, it returns true. If 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 it returns true, returns true, then returns true, then the file is opened. The file is opened. Opened writing mode. The file is opened in writing mode. File is opened writing mode. Okay. Otherwise. Otherwise, otherwise it returns so false. Clear, guys? First one. Which purpose? These are the properties. Name of the file. Mode of the file. This writable is a function. It returns either true value or false value. If it returns true, then the file is opened only writing mode. Okay. Otherwise, it returns the value false value. Now, next one is the readable. Readable. It returns either true or false value. If if it returns true, if if it returns true, it returns true, then the file is then the file is opened. The file is opened. The file is opened. Reading mode. Just the file is opened. In reading mode. That's clear. Next one. Okay. Otherwise, it returns false. Otherwise, otherwise, it returns it returns false. Clear, guys? Clear. Now, next one. Close. It returns either true or false. If it returns true, if it returns true, if it returns true, if it returns true, the file is the file is already closed. Already closed. Already closed. Otherwise, otherwise returns false. Otherwise it returns false. If the file is closed, true. Otherwise it has the value equal to false. Here, guys. Now one simple example program. Simple example program. Okay. To demonstrate. To demonstrate, to demonstrate the file properties, file properties are attributes. To demonstrate the file properties are attributes. Now, here there are the five name, mode, writable, readable, and closure. One property, for example, first to open a file, file pointer equal to open off. The file name is sample.txt or or s.txt or xyz.txt or abc.txt. And here, open a file, for example, write mode. Open a file for writing mode. For example, assume that only for writing mode. Here, a print of, print of for example, okay, fv dot name, file dot name, print of file pointer dot mode, file pointer dot mode, and print of file pointer dot writable, writable, and print of file pointer dot readable, readable, readable. And print of file pointer dot closed, closed. 
Okay. Now this is up to here. And close the comment class because of the theory part. And now we are example one program. Program is expanded with some document. Here, guys. Now here, this function, this program, this module returns error. What is the error? Well, syntax error. So now the xx dot py file. Clear. Now what is the syntax error? Here, the syntax error is writable. Writable is a function. We observe this very important and readable is also function. Now run this one. Run this one. Now here. Okay. A colon users lectures.py unexpected end of file. Now this one open. Okay. Open a file. Check that PY file, file attributes. Without any parentheses, please after closing, close the parentheses. Now here, please have this one. Four points. One is, one is. Is this one, observe this one. Okay. The first one is, this is the first one. Open a file. Second one is, file pointer dot name. Here, the file pointer dot name is sample.txt, the name of the file. And this is a mode. This function is the W mode. And writable, open a file in writable purpose. Writable is true. And now the readable is false. And the closed loop false. But we are not closing the file. Already the file is opened without any closing. Clear. For example, again, run second. Run one. For example, you are using R. R. You run this one. Okay. Now, please observe this one each and every line. The first one reading mode. File name is sample.txt. Mode is read mode. Clear. Okay. First next function. Writable function. False. Here the readable function. True. Here the closed loop. False. Clear up this one. All of you. Now we'll go to another next time. For example, here we are using different operation. For example, A plus B. A plus. A plus made appending and reading. For example, write the program in different types. For example, file name. This file name equal to comma file name dot so file. File mode equal to because okay. writable, writable equal to true or false, readable equal to equal to true or false, closed or not, closed, closed equal to L1 dot closed. Now, please observe this one, write this program. Now, here, first one, first one, the first, this is a line, first statement. First statement is sample.txt. Now, second statement is file pointer dot name. The name of the file pointer is sample.txt. Clear. Third one, file mode, A plus mode. Now, the A plus mode means is here the reading and writing is possible. Writable, true. And the readable, true. File is closed, not closed. That is equal to false. Clear. Same program is running. For example, assume that change the code. Now, here, file pointer dot close. Okay, close this function. Close the file. After closing, after closing, after closing, write the syntax. Write the closing or not. Okay, here, closed equal to fp dot closed. Here, here, file is not closed. So it is the value false. Here, the file is already closed. Then it is the value equal to two. Now, run this one. Okay. Yeah. I'll point not F4, F3. Run this one. Okay. Clear. Execute one by one line. The first line, sample.txt. File point dot name, sample.txt. Mode, A plus mode. Reading, writing true. Reading also true. Here the file is closed. False. Please observe this one. Again, next statement the file is closed. And then execute file closed attribute. Now the value equal to true. Clear, guys? Okay. For example, here we are using only for, only for W plus mode. W plus mode running. Okay. Writing true, mode is W plus, sample txt, W plus, writing true, reading true, closing false, first one, and after closing, the closing statement equal to true. Clear, guys? These are the file attributes in Python, theory part, and with the example program. Here, guys, up here.
Thanks for watching this video. Thank you very much.